What's going on everybody? So a couple days ago I did a video of um, Netbait Dagger 4.5 and I talked about what you can actually do with it. So I went out and I bought some Booyah. These are the finance jigs right there. Um, they're pretty cool because you get two of them in a pack. Uh, they're a little bit more on the finesse side so if you can see here um, and what I've done is I've just cut a dagger down okay so I'll take you take one out of the package so you can see what it looks like so this is its average length this is what it's supposed to be four and a half and you can see significant different size so the trailer is about there so I cut I don't know four ribs probably about right about there I cut about that much off and I've left it on this jig and I gotta tell you, this is the black shadow color. For black and blue, this thing is perfect. It matches great. It's actually a really small profile. Um, give you my hand as a reference. Okay. Um, and I left these together. I didn't pull these apart. And I did that because depending on how the bite is, if they're super aggressive, if they're spawning, they're up on their beds, um, they'll hit it and they'll hit it hard. But if they're real finicky this will help that presentation when it falls it's going to fall slower okay and this is just going to kind of elevate like this and then when you get it in the water you can just sit there and pump it almost like a almost like a straight tail on a shaky head um and for me i'm a jig guy through and through so this is i think this is going to be real real deadly this year um and it's so versatile. I can, I, like I said, I can rip these apart and make it into a more of a speed fishing and get more action out of it. Or I can keep them together. I can even rip these small appendages off right here on the sides here and dis, you know, disperse even less water. So for me, the dagger is going to be a vital key in my tackle box from now on out. It's just so versatile. And it's great because it's multi-purpose. You can use it as a flipping bait. Um, you can even use it on a shaky head, believe it or not. Um, if you don't want to go with this jig and you don't want to go with a big profile, you can throw it on a shaky head. Um, so that's just something that I plan on doing with it. I got it in a couple colors. I know a lot of guys like using jigs on a cross, which if you haven't checked them out, that's what you want to check out right there. These are great for swimming them too on an eighth ounce weight, but let me know what you guys think. Leave the comments below, and uh, y'all have a good night.